Really pleased with how this has turned out. Why didn't you read it? Well, it looks spray fresh spray, doesn't it? Happy or not? Yeah. <laughs> You're getting a cold pump to hot, and then you want a, a cold come off here, cold tap in the bathroom, and cold for the shower bath. And the cold continues then to work its way down. A cold on the kitchen, cold to go into hot water heater, and then pumps. <laughs> this week's video is sponsored by Skillshare. A fresh week on the boat. We're always a little bit patchy at the start of the week, so we're like, here, there, everywhere, trying to figure out what we're going to do, what we can, can't do. So bear with us this morning. <laughs> it's not even this morning, it's actually nearly 4 pm. Um, Danny's adjusting from night shift. Yeah, it's bank holiday Monday and I've just finished night. So Joe let me sleep in and then, yeah, we're going to have a late one here, hopefully, and yeah. try and get some of this tongue and groove on the wall, which hopefully will make the boat look a lot more livable. Yeah. Goodbye, spray foam. <laughs> Before we start, we're going to have to move all this out of the way. We're going to start at the bow. <laughs> I forgot then. We're going to start at the bow, work our way back this way. What side's this? Starboard. Yeah. Start I this side, I you reckon? I can't remember the other words, Port. so I was going to say before. <laughs> yeah, not sure which side yet. We're going to have a tidy up. Well, not even a tidy up, just a move around so that we can work. A couple of bits we could do before, actually, before I forget. Yeah. Long runner pipe and some conduit. Somewhat. Conduit, what the pipes, uh, the cable's gonna sit in. Hmm, sweet, right. Let's ease our way into the day then. I'll move stuff there. All right, so for the cold feed, we're using 15 mil Hep2O Flexi. Just trying to figure out where, where it's gonna go and junction off. We need a cold feed into the bathroom, aren't we? Please don't ask me about stuff like this, I haven't got a clue. Cold feed into the bathroom, hot feed into the bathroom. Yeah, but it's got to come from the tank. One cold feed, and then tease off this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, I'm going to put my knee pads on because I'm an old man and I get poorly knees if I don't. What do you mean to do? Hold it up. I'm just trying to think. Can I just say that there's no spray from on that bit? Underneath. I think that's you a bit. Mm. Yeah, you're all right. <laughs> Maybe we start on the other side then. Well, I still need to do this anyway. All I need to do is put these pipe clips up because once the tongue grooves down, it's just a bit of a pain. You won't get the drill in there. Yeah. And the water needs to be at the bottom, so we're now doing this the right way around. We just need to check those. What do you mean it's under the bottom? The water you want basically because of if the pipe burst. If it bursts, it's going to spray everywhere, but if it's dripping, you don't want to drip it onto your electric, so you have the water pipe as the lowest yeah. point and electric to go above. That's not very big space for the electrics. What, up above? Yeah. Yeah, but it's not that much that needs to come up here. You've got, uh, we're going to have a socket up here, and your lights are going to be run up above, and then a couple 12 volt plugs. So there's not, you only need one length for that trunk in, or two lengths, tops. Take measure of a meter, please. Let me see if I can guess where. See how far off I'm going to be. I think it needs to go. Is that a meter? A hundred? Yeah, hundred centimeters. Unless you're at hundred inches, but I reckon there. What we need to figure out is you're getting a cold, basically it comes from the water tank, pumped to hot, uh, pu pumped, and then you want a, a cold to come off here, for the cold tap in the bathroom and cold for the shower bath, and then the cold continues then to work its way down, you want a cold on the kitchen, and then you also want a cold to go into hot water heater, and then pumps <laughs> back, so you need to do two runs of pipes. I reckon the cable's going to have to be mounted on up here, so we're going to have to do two rows of these, because you have to have a cold coming back, a hot coming back. See what I mean? Which is fine, I'll just do another pipe clip there. Where's the electrics going to go there? Mount it up here on a bit of timber or something, I'll figure something out. <laughs> Right, 
Right, scrap that. It's a good job we've got Danny here because we're actually going to run the pipe work along the floor level because none of it's going to be seen anyway because we're going to have a bed which is boxed in, bathroom box in, kitchen, where it goes to is going to be boxed in. So take these out and then our cable clips go in instead. Oh well. You could do this for a line to do them on the floor now, they're great. Yeah, I will, yeah. What's this resource? Yeah. Yeah. Can't be a so if you leave that like that for now, just hold it like that, innit? You put the what in? If I put another one of the pipe in, just hold it there, look. Then we can unravel it as and when, innit? Yeah, lovely. So I bought a load of 20mm conduit to run the electrical cables through to keep them from chafing and whatever whilst it moves. Um, I'm just going to figure out, I've actually bought the solid conduit tees and stuff so i've gone oversized and the actual size i don't know if they're going to fit let's try the standard tee first that's going to fit oh it fit oh it fits. fit good Ooh. let me and then basically that means you can put in extra additional cables oh Quite our beauty blogger over there. Woo! Lovely. Right. There you go. Now, let's think where. Do we have to think where electrics are going to be, like what we want? Yep. So. So. Hang on, we're going to talk and then we're going to. Because this could go on for a wee while. This is my lovely drawing with Joe's help. So this is this side of the boat, so it's going to be like this. Um, so we're having 240 volt on this bit, so it'll be right by the sofa. We're going to have one in the breakfast bar and then one in the bedroom. And then the 12 volt, we're going to have one in the bedroom again, one in the breakfast bar. Well, well they're actually all in the same place. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's just a bit easier to visual. Yeah what we're doing, or what Joe's doing. What's on the menu then? Um, so we've got Korean spice noodles with just everything that we had left in the fridge. Shiitake mushrooms, some... Um, what are they called? Those green things? And onion. And so, pepper. Lovely, right. We're gonna have a nice little lunch and we'll see you in a minute. Can I go first? Yeah. Oh, Take a couple of videos out of this. We're going to stop doing this and we're going to move on to tone and groove on the other side because we've realised we need to... Put tape, cables in first. Yeah, put the cables in first, otherwise it's just making our lives ten times more difficult. <laughs> oh wow. Oh, I bet that shines up great on <laughs> our faces. I suppose it dampens the surface. Yeah. If we brush and dab a little bit of water on it. If it falls off, we blame all 150 people that commented to tell us how to use it. <sighs> Why didn't you read it? Well, it looks spray doesn't it? Oh, 
Looks dodgy looking as well. Huh? Looks fine. Ye of little faith. So we've decided we're going to call it a day for now. We've got neighbours today. Um, it's quite late to start using the chop saw. So we're going to just have a bit of a tidy up, move over to this side. So then first thing tomorrow we can start on this walk. Off to a great start today. Danny has already dipped <laughs> my hoodie. I might say my hoodie that she's borrowing. She's dipped the arm in the toilet already with we. So she's wearing my other hoodie now. <laughs> right. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to get straight into it. Starting on the tongue and groove. This silly bunting's got to come down. Can I pull these off first. That turned out right. Yeah, you do what you need. Um, and then I'm going to run a string line along to try and keep them all level. I think that's going to help. Let's see. I will let Danny off for dipping the arm in the toilet because she got an Indian in for us. It was lovely. What do we have? Sagaloo. Vegetable biryani. Vegetable biryani. Uh, paneer sagaloo. Paneer sagaloo. That's it. Is that it? Stuffed, absolutely full. Feeling a bit unmotivated now, but we're going to try and hit right into it. Can't we? Yeah. Ready? Ready. Come on, man. Come on, man, I'm everybody. Oh, I've got the milk. That's fine. I don't need milk, but iron brew. So we just realised we're going to need to get some more of this strip wood because the only fixings that these pieces that are getting cross cut are going to be fixed to is that and then they'd like go into that so we're going to put, I've got one spare piece to go along the top here and Danny's going to run and get us some more to go along the bottom and for the other side we're going to have the same issue and I'm not quite sure what's going to happen around the windows but we shall see when we get there. Got the first tricky cut to do. I've lost the piece. Oh, there it is. It's a jigsaw. It's a jigsaw. Oh, yeah. How beautiful this looks. I am very pleased with it. Um, I put one the wrong way up a minute ago, but luckily we spotted it. So they're in the right way. We're gonna sand these back and paint the nails so you won't see any of them. But yeah, really starting to frame our hatch.
at that. Two windows framed. You well, only thought we were going to get to here. I did. I, I didn't oh, think no, we were going to get past the first window. No, I didn't think we were... Yeah, the first window we were going to do. Lovely. Right. We're going to go home, have something to eat. We'll catch you in the morning. I want to take a minute to thank this week's sponsor, Skillshare. Skillshare is an incredible online learning platform with thousands of classes to choose from. Whether you're a beginner wanting to learn a new skill or keen to further an existing passion, there is something on there for everyone. I've been exploring classes on an array of topics including film and video, photography, productivity as well as health and well-being and plant care. My favourite part about Skillshare is being able to access it around my busy schedule, both through the computer and the app. I have several classes downloaded to my phone, you can even filter the length of the class to suit your downtime. A class I recently discovered is a Skillshare original, Sustainable Living Basics simple steps to make an impact by Catherine Kellogg helping to remind me that what we do as individuals truly does matter and can have a ripple effect on the people around us Skillshare is created solely for learning meaning there are no ads they are always launching new premium classes the first thousand of you lovely lot to click the link in our description will get one month's free premium membership let us know in the comments what creative classes you have tried we'd love to explore them for ourselves now back to the build good morning good morning Back to Tongue and Groove. Tongue and Grooving. No time to waste. No time to waste. Also, we just shipped another t shirt across to America. Christine in Vancouver, Washington. Thank you very much. <laughs> this video is coming out a couple of weeks after we've posted it, so you probably received it by the time this <laughs> video is live. So. But anyway, and by the time this video is live, the t shirts will be back in stock up to double XLs. Oh, they're going straight in. Go on. Is <laughs> it the right way? Please, right, right. Go steady. Right, I'll oh, put that on tripod. So we just stopped for lunch and watched someone's rather nice brand new wide beam getting cranked in. It very was, nice. It was very nice, one of the best we've seen, but I do love our boat. And um, we've nearly finished one wall. We've just got this part of the window to do. We're gonna do it up to about here, so just clear the window. Um, we're not gonna go all the way along because we wanna um, make it easier for ourselves to be able to put the ply, ply lining in. Um, and it's gonna be a bit more complicated if we do that the whole way up, so yeah. We're gonna frame the window and then leave it there. Yeah. So it's just a clean run after that. Uh -huh. And then we're gonna start the same end on the other side now. Are until we, we run out. How much we've got left? I thought we won't. We're not gonna do that. No, might as well right. save that for next week. <sighs> just heard the people open a lovely bottle of champagne. We never opened a bottle of champagne when we had our book, did we? I think we might have had a beer. We can do it. It's more our budget. Complete. Once it's complete and we've gone our first yeah. finished cruise. Right. We move inside again. We need to finish off the window, yeah? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm all over the place. Right, finish off this window then, shall we? Yeah. I'd shut the door if I were you. Nice bit of air coming in. It's a bit warm. I'll show him your actress either. <laughs> Better than you. Straight line for that. Why is it stuck? You. Clamp, yeah. Not then, mate. <laughs> Ready? Not then? 
Yeah. Love it. Just tack them this side because then we can get that out without breaking the tongues. And then if we need to adjust it as we go along. Not. Danny's trying to stitch me up, make me cut through this. What's the problem? It's a knot. Am I not? Character. phrase of the week has been, we're going to trim it. You're caught around the thingy, by the way. Try pod. Yeah. Yeah, she's on it. Joe, I just said that. No, I just need more slack. Loosely, and then hammer them in now, just in case we've got to take them out. Alright, I got We're having a little bit of trouble. Once these go on their separate ways, joining them back up at the other end of the window. If you're wondering what sort of ratio there is between who does most of the work, Danny's currently playing the swans. Look at our beautiful wall. Nice, isn't it? Sturdy. Sturdy. Put it back in. What's that glue it? Oh. Whoops. I'm confused. What are you doing? No, no, that goes on the front. Oh. Yeah. I'm trying to glue that or we we could take it out as whether we can we can get that out without taking all of them out. Nothing's ever simple, is it? <sighs> Tell you the last, very last piece. Oh, if I tack that in, I chuck a tack, a um, little nail through it and tack it on. That's why we sanded and painted, you ain't ever gonna bloody know anyway. That's if we don't leave this clip in. Is that your glue? Yeah. Don't film too closely. <laughs> right, now I'm going to tack that. But we need, it needs, it, yeah, it will fall off at one point if we don't tack it on it. Nice and gently then. There's probably a bit more meat. Top and bottom, what do you reckon? Or in the middle? Oh, yeah. Yeah? No. no. <laughs> Joe, I just think your fingers, kids. Yeah, she's right. Yeah. <laughs> Great. No, 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 wait, wait. Quick 
great work. This might not make it into the into the edit, guys. If you can see this, you like it, right? <laughs> Sand and fill that after. Really pleased with how this has turned out. One side down. And he's just priming all the edges that were cut and left exposed. Yeah, really pleased with it. What's next? Um, move everything to the other side and prep for when we've actually cut and painted the other. Yeah. Two, that's all of them now that we don't that's, We've got these spare. Got like <gasps> and then 15 spare. you're going to do some wiring, won't you? Yeah. I'll just like a little bit of running cables and whatnot before we do box that in. Slight change of plan. We're going to put a little trims up to finish it off a little bit more. Yeah? Yeah. And then we're going to go home because it's a bit later than we thought. And I've got to edit this video and last week's video still. Ah, oh, we can't do this yet. We've got to do skirting first. Alright. When are we doing the skirting? Not sure yet. Once we've done the floor. <laughs> the floor's done. Yeah, but the, the rope caught oh. Right, scrap that as well then. <laughs> Should we just call it a day? Should we move, we'll tidy everything and move it to one side so then we're ready. And then we'll see you next week. Yeah? See you next week. Bye! Right, what are you doing? Put, put a pipe in a clip. Like that? Yeah, push it in. Push it yeah, hard and then do one trigger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then we got to figure out how we're cutting in that. Well, this bit's fine, <laughs> and like this bit will be alright. Just angle. Just angle, isn't it? Oh yeah. Skillshare is created solely for learning, meaning there are no ads. Oh my god. Skillshare is created. Two, one, trigger. <laughs> ah! No, 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 no